This video is just for advice. Always make sure that you use a qualified electrician or somebody who's competent to do um, wiring. My name's Alan Hart and I've been asked, um, Jack, Jack has asked and a, a few other people how to wire heating systems. So in this video, I'm gonna show you how to wire an underfloor heating heating system. So we'll have a look at this wiring center and I'll do a step-by-step -step video on how to wire it, where the wires go, etc, etc. Alright, so yeah, let's have a look at it now. We've got this wiring centre here now. I'm going to wire this up. So I've started with the mains. So this is as live, as neutral and as earth. This would normally just go to a spur. And then what we'll do, we'll move into these different um, terminals here. And I'll show you how to wire each individual section of this. Uh, this wiring centre, we need to put a link in there. It says timer there. Very important we put that link in, otherwise it won't work. This is if you've got a separate control, a se separate timer, then, then you can wire it into this. But in this particular case, we need to put a link in because we're going to have a programmable room start. Now we've got the pump wires. And the pump wires go in there and it clearly says it on there pump so it's very very easy to understand and that's just going onto his pump there and that's just got a plug-in connection uh, plug-in connection on there so now we've wired the zone valve into this so we've got the zone valve there and we've got as orange as gray as brown as blue and there's earth there. It does say it on it as well. So it's clear, really easy to do. Now we've wired the switch live to the boiler. So it's the on off. So this is what your link would be for like your room stat. And that's wired in there. And again, it shows you there, boiler. So it's really, really easy to see and do. It's also the reason, one of the main reasons you'd use this wiring center is it's then got its relays built in. So when you get your power back down this orange, it won't back feed on your, on your pump. What I've done here, I've just put a link in. You can put a link in, it could be in any of these here, but you link in the, the, the live terminal and the L1. That, if you're gonna put a room stat in, these, this is where the wires would go. One thing to bear in mind with this, it, it has about an eight minute delay. So when you do turn it on, it will, it, you know, it will not work straight away. So that's just something to bear in mind. Um, shortly, I'll wire the thermostat on here as well. I'll show you how to wire that in. To wire the controls up on this, again, it's very, very easy. It's all labeled, so I'll turn it right way around. So we've got this neutral which is obviously the blue. So then we've got as live, which is as brown. And then we've got L1, which is a switch live. And what we'd normally do is we'd normally sleeve that with with some brown sleeving. I haven't got any brown sleeving um, for the purposes of this video. Um, but yeah, so we normally have brown sleeving on that. I'll show you how to wire this now to the boiler. To the, uh, not the boiler, the actual wiring centre. So that's this thermostat there now, that's just temporary there. I'm gonna put a nest on here. So what I'll do is I'll do a video on how to swap it over for a nest as well. Um, but there's there as wires in there. So it's very clear. So if we look on that one, it's easy to see. So it's got a neutral, it's got a live, and it's got a switched live. So there, so as you see, neutral, live, switched live. As I say, normally we'd have some brown sleeving on there, but we don't have any. So I'm going to switch this on shortly, and as I say, this this will have an eight minute delay on this. I've wired it all up now, and we've got the controller working. See why is that bomb? This is just a it's just temporary, just to show you how to do it. If we turn this up now, This will then call for heat. It 
it took about five minutes last time for this to fire up. So that's how you would wire your wiring center for your underfloor heating system. This heating system, this is the beneath heat system. So that's that beneath heat manifold. And then obviously it's got the pump and all the bits there. And that's the beneath heat wiring center. I'm sure there's other wiring centers that are, that are similar, but this is the one that I've used on this particular install.